that first time we met is just something clicked. We wanted to film a music video yeah, and take pictures. So we wanted to go out in like the middle of nowhere, do like a whole shtick. We wanted to bring a couch out there. It was yeah. like a whole thing. And so Ethan was the first person we asked because he could not stop talking about his film cameras. And this was even before they had kind of met. Yeah. It was more just like Caleb was like, tell you through this, this and that, and then we'll just- You're like the it. interpreter. Yeah, that was like one of the probably first times we ever hung out in a group setting. Yeah. Weirdly enough. I think we all have a lot of similar uh, interests and it just kind of worked out that way. Idle Falls, if you've ever been there, it's a very beautiful town, but very not music oriented. They had one venue there when we first started the band and they wouldn't let anyone who wasn't like already known play. So it was really tough to get a foot in the door. That's why AJ was saying earlier, we played at a lot of parties. We played at a lot of houses. It was always like, hey, my parents aren't home. Come over and play for a few hours. And eventually the lakes got big enough that we were able to play shows at the actual venues and stuff. But we were like, ah, we, I don't want to play the same venue every weekend. Like that's yeah. just, we're just doing the same thing over and over. And so I told the lakes, I was like, hey, I love you guys. But if we want to keep doing this and actually like do it, do it, we got to go somewhere where there's like more music, where music is part of the city. And Boise was the first city that came to mind for me because they have tree fort there's always shows every week there's always stuff going on there's a lot of cool people up here and when i first moved up here everyone was on board but then two of the members got cold feet just for different reasons that gave the opportunity for ethan when he graduated high school to move up here and we ended up getting this house but now it's ghost beach because we were like well let's we moved up here to do music and then when ethan moved here we were like well let's keep making music Tree Fort is a collective of artists and musicians that put on yearly, they're on year 12 now. Something yeah, this will be 12. This yeah. is 12, they're on their 12th year. They bring in musicians and artists from all around the nation to celebrate music for a week during spring break. Brady came to practice one day and he was like, guys, I just went to Tree Fort last year <laughs> and Tree Fort would be super, super cool. And Ethan and I had never heard of it. Yeah. So we were like, what the hell is that? So he was telling us about it, showing us the lineup and shit. And we were like, holy cow, we can, like, we could do that. So we went to Ethan's mom's house one weekend and we recorded the song and we sent it to Tree Fort. And we were like, hey, please, we're banned from Idle Falls. We would love to come play. They ended up getting back to us and they were like, hey, I'm sorry, but we don't have enough room right now. So I think a big thing, at least for me, was playing Tree Fort. That was, that was that the was goal. That was a huge goal. I was like, I always, like, playing in a music festival in our home state would be so so cool i remember the moment we found out we were getting into tree fort it was the last day it was january 15th we were like okay we probably didn't get into tree fort because it was like the very last second and i'm going to bed it's like 1 30 in the morning mm -hmm. and caleb's out here like on his phone and i'm just like dozing off and he's like ethan get the fuck out here and i'm like oh my god <laughs> yeah. the dog is dead i'm like this some shit happened yeah and then he's like we got in and we were just like literally like jumping up and down like holding hands type yeah. thing like it was crazy. I handled the taxes for it. I did not finish my homework assignment that night. If you put a gun to our heads though, and was like, uh, what note is this on the fretboard? We, None of us, no. We've played shows that have, we, like, we've upset other musicians with how little we know. We're the, we're the new kids on the block for sure. And so it could be, pretty tough sometimes interacting with like Boise musicians and they're all super sweet. We haven't had a negative interaction with any Boise musicians yet. The most important thing when you're playing music with your friends is just to remember that, you know, you're with your friends. And I think we have the most fun on stage out of any band that I've ever seen. And I think audiences can really tell. And at the end of the day, you know, it's all a fun moment and make it as fun as possible and enjoy yourself. <laughs>